What's up, everybody? Um, <clears throat> this is, um, we got uh, Marcus Meridian over here. Um, I just recently picked up my PS3 um, from um, from my mother's house. It was over there. I used to live there like a while ago. But yeah, I actually picked it up. And um, I have been having the hugest hankering to play Super Puzzle Fighter I'm kind of I'm kind of making this like the uh, default sort of first episode for this um, series that I was thinking about doing on this channel called um, Marcus Likes It Hard, and uh, it's pretty much I I play a game on the hardest possible, you know, like it's not like super impossible, you know. <laughs> I'm not that crazy, but anyway, I was actually working on a, a different episode. Uh, for that, but I sort of messed up on it. Uh, I, I, I didn't really save, so I had to start all over, and I was like... No. <laughs> so, I'm gonna play regular, um, classic X mode. Um, but I'm gonna play on Expert. I haven't played this game in a long time. So let's see how it goes. Alright. Hmm, let's see, how does this, uh, how does this game work again? Oh, okay. Here we go. It's it's all coming back. Boomerang, you know, it's all coming back. Let's see how uh, how long it takes for me to become. Hopefully, it doesn't take too long because uh, I'm kind of a, a a seasoned master at this game. Like it's been forever, but you know, like Dark Souls, if you become good at the game, then. I don't know. I, I, I haven't taken a break from that series, so I have no idea. But anyway, enough about that game. Let's talk about this game. Um, anyone who's ever played this game or knows this game knows that it's an instant classic. And if they do not agree, then they need to shut up because they're wrong. And um, yeah, it's uh, this came out in the arcade games. I used to actually... This is a spin-off from another spin-off. Um... The um, Pocket Fighter, which is Street Fighter character and Dark Sider characters, but in like, you know, these chibi forms in a fighting game. And you had a bunch of gems, and these gems helped you fill up your special meters. And so, pretty much, you know, they took the gems and made this. Uh, I forgot the name of the game that um, it's inspired by, or it's kind of like. There's another, there's like a puzzle game that's before this that has this style where it's not like a match three where they all just explode immediately. Jeez, uh, it's been a while. All right, here we go. So it shouldn't, if memory serves, it shouldn't be too hard for the first few matches. So I should be good. Yeah, right, you think you're gonna attack me? Oh, watch this, here we go, pro, pro move right here. Pow! Oh my gosh, these pro stats. These pro strats. Oh. I might as well. She's not even going to survive. So, bye. Oh, she survived. Well, that shut me up. That's okay. See, the whole the whole strategy of this game is the ability to um um like adapt, you know. And I recently just got through Dark Souls 2, so I know a little bit about adaptability. Um, oh, there you go. I wasn't even paying attention. Boom. Gone. Ooh, we got Ryu up in here. How many, pe how many people still call him Ryu? He's the guy from Ninja Gaiden. <laughs> Sorry, I am part Japanese. I cannot, I cannot speak such, such blasphemous, um, pronunciations. Of my native tongue. Japanese actually was my um, first language I learned. I sound like I'm talking to like a chat or something, sort of, but I'm not. I'm very alone and, and, and lonely and alone. Um, and I just like to pretend I have friends. Alright, here we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, this is gonna hurt. BAM! It didn't hurt. Oh, there it goes. Now it finally... Now it finally hurt. 
should have connected the chain or something with that. Okay. There. That should destroy him. Yes. What do we got? Bam! We got Donovan up in here. Donovan is from Darkstalkers. I don't... I've never actually played... Um, as him, or with him, or near him, or... Or whatever. You know, I mostly... When I played that game, I mostly picked... Um, Felicia, obviously. Because I'm a total cat person. And also... Um, I forgot his name. He, he's the... Um, the, the, the rocker dude that has like the mouth on his stomach. I forgot his name, but he was pretty cool too. Also, the werewolf was pretty dope. Reminds, kind of reminds me of, um, or makes me think of, oh my gosh, look at this gem. Goodbye. I'm sorry. There's no mercy. I have to get through this quick so then I can start losing to, um, Akuma and, um, Whoever else they're going to have. Sometimes Ken can be a bastard. Sometimes he can be a real bastard. Oh my gosh, he actually made it through my defenses. Oh. He didn't make it through the match, though. The round. Oh, which is actually the round. Or the match. I don't know what I'm talking about. Man, we are punching through this. This is the intermission. I don't know if you all can, if it's picking up the sirens, but, um, that is sometimes my, um, my lullaby. It's hard for me to go to sleep if I can't hear sirens. So, you know, living in this place is one of the best places for me if I want to get sleep because they have drugs. I mean, they have sirens. <clears throat> uh, all the sirens. <clears throat> sirens! <clears throat> Mm-hmm. I'm not building at all, but I don't feel like I need to. You know, this is this is still the easy peeps, I think. Although Waifu Sakura is here fighting me, so but we're gonna pretend that this is Nega Sakura. And um so she's evil. She's evil. Um kaboom. And then kaboom. And then a dying? And then pretty soon a dead? A Dell? A Dell computer? Anyway, goodbye. Oh! Ooh, I saw that diamond coming and I was like, no! No! I already said goodbye. I don't want to look like a fool. Alright, here we go. Sakura versus Morrigan. The, um, the teenage fetish versus the vampire? I don't know. Psh. Boom. See, it, it also, it comes with its own sound effects when you play, when you play correctly. It's like when you play Dark Souls, the only correct way to play that game is to, um, Roll into everything. Might as well, whatever. Ah, uh, boom! I totally countered whatever she was gonna do. Oh, three chain! Bam! <laughs> oh man, this game. This game is great. Um, I actually, I have this game, and I have um another game. I was actually gonna do the other game first. Um, but then I ended up picking up my PS3, and I was like, you know what? I haven't played this thing in a while. I also have the OG, like, launch version of Skyrim on here. And last time I played that version, it was such a Bethesda mess that it was amazing, and I kind of want to re-jump into that. Because I've been like, I've been actually wanting to play Skyrim again because I've been watching a lot of Skyrim videos. And um, so I was like, 
man, Skyrim would be fun, and I was trying to look for it on the PS4, and I'm just like, it's still a little pricey. And I'm like, wait a second, I could play the best version now, the launch version, which has the most features out of any um, Bethesda game. Well, actually, no. Um, I had this, I had this uh, copy of Oblivion. It was the gaudy edition of Oblivion. Um, you know, since I have this, I can also play Oblivion again. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> I'm not PC Master Race, so, you know, I'm not cool like that. Um, but, the, um, um, but yeah, I had Oblivion on there, and it was a Gotti edition, and I played that game so much that I think it ran out of Steam. <laughs> Because, uh, well, it didn't run out of steam. It ran, it, it added a whole bunch of steam, really, I suppose. Uh, but anyway, oh, I didn't want to destroy that. No! Damn you, Oblivion! Damn you! Um, but, but uh, anyway, um, I'll get rid of that right now. Um, oops. I played that game so much uh, that it started to bug out so hard that, um,. I, I uh, one time I went to jail in I think it was in that was fast. Um, and I am burning through this really quickly. Um, but I was um. You're quick, smart, and cheap. No, wait, that's me. Ah! Please let me actually fight Dan for real. Can I actually fight Dan for real? No, this he doesn't. You don't actually fight him in expert mode. I don't think. Okay, so let's see how many times I lose or win to this one. Um, but anyway, so I was playing that game. Yeah, I played that game so much that I went to jail um, in, uh, um, what is that place? Brahma? Bruma? Something like that. Um, I, went to, I went to prison over there. And um, when I got out, a whole bunch of NPCs just spawned with me. And I was like... <laughs> What the heck is going on? And then they're all just kind of standing there for a second, and then they all just left. They all just started leaving. And I was like, okay, what's up with this? And so I talked to one of them, and apparently... Um, he was uh, in charge of, um, of an inn, and I actually bought a room. Um, out in the, out in the field, he was walking. I was following him because I was curious. I'm like, where are these people actually going? Oh, that's gonna hurt! Bam! I was like, are these people actually like walking somewhere? And they were actually walking to wherever they they came from. You know, whatever town they came from. And um, one of them was talking to me about like bollywogs and stuff like that. And I was like, what? Those Pokemans? And then I'm like, oh, wait a second, this is... Oh, I defeated him. Woo! Thank you, Oblivion. Um, <laughs> it's like, this is a chick from, um... Freaking, um... From the DLC, so she actually crossed out through the strange door into my... Into my world, into the main game, and then I knew that because I followed her. And she actually goes to the water and starts swimming, and then she'll go into the island. Because I had no idea where she was, so I went ahead and I cast Detect Life, and I saw this little purple fuzzy thing inside, and I was like, what? But anyway, um, went completely off tangent from anything, but, um, so that was, uh, Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo, um, I just, this was just kind of like a for fun episode I just want to throw out, um, I absolutely knew I would be able to beat this game on the hardest difficulty. It's not really that hard for me. Um, but if, um, if if you guys want to see me actually play a super hard game and have massive massive fits about it, uh, just let me know. Uh, I might just jump into the Skyrim and just make a new character. Who knows? I also have other PS3 games here too. Um, but I'm super excited because this means I get to play Demon Souls, and that's one game I've been wanting to play. So, but anyway, um, go ahead and um, like if you liked. Um, also, if you didn't like, you can go ahead and also like because it'll help my self-esteem. 
Um, because I'm a loser like that. Add the violin. Anyway, um, but yeah, subscribe to check out for more and whatnot. So, peace.